Hi guys, welcome to Ask a Little Witch. Okay, so this is the August 2017 mid-month predictions. Um, I haven't done them in a while, so apologies for that, but I have been committing to my weekly predictions. Um, to get a weekly prediction, you just have to follow me on Facebook. Um, it's just Ask a Little Witch, you'll be able to find me, or just click the link down in the info box below. Um, or sign up for the newsletter and it will just go straight to email. Um, but that being said, obviously this is, or the rest of August, is going to include the um, solar eclipse. So I'm not going to get into what, an, what a solar eclipse is, um, but I will be telling you how it's going to impact you. I do highly recommend that you watch your rising sign, as I find that that points to the most relevant kind of point of action of how this solar eclipse is going to be affecting you um, but obviously do check out your sun and your moon sign um, because I'm still going to be channeling very quick impromptu messages from spirit in regards to what's going to be happening for you uh, for the rest of August of 2017 so let me stop rambling and now let's just jump into what this month or the rest of this month has in store for you. Hi Scorpio, suns, moons and rising signs so the solar eclipse is going to be affecting your subscriber count. Now, this is a time where your your direction in life, you know, is changing. The way that people are seeing you is changing. You know, you're very much going to be on show. Now, Scorpios don't usually like so much attention, depending on the attention that they're getting. You know, so it kind of feels like within the next six months, you're going to feel exposed in some way okay be that what that means for you specifically now at the same time anything that you keep just beneath the surface you know you're very much poker face so anything that you keep beneath the surface is nagging at you and it's gonna come straight up to the surface for I'm gonna say all to see but it doesn't have to mean literally everyone to see um, so I just feel like people are viewing you differently people are seeing you differently and Scorpio already has it down with you know you can't please everyone not everyone's gonna love you okay and you're a very honest person usually you know you just say things how they are um, usually again so there could be changes in regards to that now the most common theme for a solar eclipse in the 10th house is going to be the fact that you change jobs you know in a nutshell within the next six months or so um, or there's a change in regards to your work in the world. There's a change in the way in which something is being seen, in the way that you are being seen. So, that being said, now let's have a little see of what's going to be happening for the rest of August. Okay. So, something that has been the same for a very, very, very long time okay it's almost like something that you would never expect to change like something that is like a constant something that is dead certain is going to change and i feel like this is a good thing okay because i feel like it's well overdue it was meant to happen it was meant to happen and it was meant to happen and finally within the next six months it's going to be happening so there is a well overdue change in the making um, and I feel like it's only just kind of starting to transition um, towards the end of August. So this is just what I get for you guys. Hopefully it will resonate. Let me know in the comments down below. And I will see you for the monthlies at the end of the month. Unless obviously you check me out on Facebook or get a reading. In which case I will speak to you really soon. So thank you so much. Bye. So gently.